G'day trendsetters, I'm John with Gravel Cyclist. G'day Tuesday. Coming to you today with a product feature of sorts. Recently, my friends at Shimano launched some updates and a new model to their line of gravel shoes. You might recognize the venerable RX-8. This shoe has been out for a couple of years. It's really lightweight. One of my favorite shoes designed for the rigors of gravel cycling. And yeah, you can use mat bike shoes if you desire. There's no rules, obviously. But Shimano went ahead and tailored this shoe specifically for this John Ross. And no matter your thoughts on that, they have launched a new model, still called the RX-8, and another model, the RX-8R. They're inside these boxes here. So without further claptrap, let's crack them open and check them out. Here they are. This is the RX-8R, I will show it to you up close in a moment. The all new model and updates to the RX-8 shoe. Here it is, the updated Shimano RX-8, otherwise known as the RX-801, which delivers a more breathable design with super stiff and efficient carbon outsole for your biggest efforts on the bike. Blending the top performance features of Shimano's premium mountain bike and road racing footwear in a shoe that balances pedaling performance and off the bike capability. Shimano claims the RX801 is your all-terrain gravel shoe optimized for gravel racers, Grand Fondo riders, and weekend warriors alike. According to Shimano, whether you're riding smooth gravel routes or climbing chunky forest service roads, the RX801 delivers maximum efficiency and comfort on all types of terrain. A wider contact area and built-in heel stabilizer. Increased control whilst the surround wrapping upper construction hugs the foot for optimal fit. Sizing news, Shimano has made the RX801 available in a ton of sizes from 38 to 48 in regular sizing, half sizes from 41 to 46, and wide sizes in 40 to 48. Another new feature is this lower profile dial, which has a nice little rubber treatment there, so it's pretty grippy. If you compare it to the original RX-8, Definitely not as low profile. In terms of finishes, this is the silver shoe. Black is also available, along with tropical leaves. The new RX801 is priced at US $275. My review set is a size 43. Here's a quick look at the included Shimano insole. And it's sort of set up for those folks who have high arches like myself. Additional insole pieces are included to optimize fit for your new shoes. Claimed weight on a size 42 is 268 grams. Onto the gram scale, this is a 43, 283, 284 grams with the insole. And here's the new shoe, the RX ATAR Gravel Racing Adventure shoe. Shimano says, are you ready to rally when the gravel riding gets rowdy? So this shoe is also known as the RX-801R and delivers all of the performance features of the RX-801 shoes, but with a snug fitting ankle cuff that boosts protection from sand, grit and pebbles. Nobody likes crap, especially pebbles, inside their shoes. So that's pretty tasty. You might have seen this sort of feature on hiking shoes and so on. So barring the cuff, this new shoe is almost identical to the RX801 right here. It also features the same carbon composite sole as the RX801 and the same low profile dial. Now there's only one color, metallic orange. It's available in regular shoe sizes, US 38 to 48, with half sizes available in 41 to 46, and US wide sizes 40 to 48. And here's its mate, the left shoe. MSRP on this shoe is US $300. Claimed weight on a size 42. This is a size 43. It's 290 grams. That's pretty tasty. 296.5. And that includes the stock insole. Here's a gander.
So there you have it, my product features of sorts of the new to market Shimano RX-8 and RX-8R gravel shoes. I'll be posting reviews of these shoes sometime in the hopefully not too distant future. As always, thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the Gravel Cyclist YouTube channel for interesting videos such as this. No bullshit gravel bike reviews, other product reviews, ride experience videos, and general madness. Uh, excuse me, what are you doing? Pardon me. Oh my God. Tuesday, what do you think of that? As all of it is released to the channel. I'll see you, hey baby, I'll see you right in the next video.